Hello! Today's devotional can be found in 1 Kings 6, chapter 16, verse 2. For as much as I exalted thee out of the dust, and made thee prince over my people Israel, and thou hast walked in the way of Jeroboam, and hast made my people Israel to sin, to provoke me to anger with their sins. So this is saying, I mean, the Lord blesses us when we try to do our best. I mean, the Lord will bless us, yes. And He will give us wonderful, wonderful blessings. However, if we just keep on going about our business the way we are and we don't try to become better, we don't even try to show gratitude, and we even slip back into wicked ways or go into wicked ways because of the blessings given us, like financial blessings or whatever. And then we start sitting like crazy. Well, the Lord's not going to be too happy because we're like mocking the blessings He has given us and we're mocking the atonement by like saying, oh, we can do better because we were given things to be able to do better, but we don't want to do better. So. Yeah, you do not want to mock God, because God's wrath is mightier than every natural disaster known to man. Everything. His, he will not be mocked. And trust me, God will find a way to humble the mockers. And I, for one, don't want to be a subject of God's wrath. So I'm doing my, my best to behave myself and be grateful for the blessings that I am given. And when I do get those blessings, those huge blessings of finance and whatever, I'm going to use them to help people and to help things become better. I mean, that's what I'd recommend to you. When you get those big blessings, use them to help people. And be Christ-like and do better. I mean, use those blessings for good and not for evil. So that we don't provoke the Lord into anger because of the sins. I mean, it's like mocking the atonement if we just keep sinning despite knowing and despite... all that God has given us and oh even though the atonement has exalted us from our former state we are not quite there yet and 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 mocking the atonement after it's rescued us from death and hell oh my I can I can only say to those who choose to do that I I hope that God shows mercy, but if he doesn't, you earned it. You earned his wrath. I mean, so we've got to monitor our behavior and our actions very carefully so we don't provoke the Lord to anger. We need to stay on the path and do the good things and embrace the atonement that we may ascend the stairway to exaltation and do better. But it's our choice. Just remember the consequences of both choices. Anyway, with that said, I love you all so very much. And I say these things humbly in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen.